can't ignore the fact that Buffy died on the same day that essentially I was given my life back. It's not coincidental that the two little creatures that got me through suicidal depression last summer was Gypsy and Buffy. In the depression, her and Gypsy both reminded me to eat because I would just forget for days on end. I guess it's possible that sometimes our animals live for us. She gave me something to focus on other than depression. She had a lot of mouth issues. She required a lot of attention over the last three years, like a lot, especially when it came to diet and mouth care and paw care and, and even shaving her. So they kind of kept me alive over this last year. How do you say thank you? The words just seem insufficient to that kind of love. And yet that is the gratitude that I feel for her and for all of you, for all your love, your kindness, your prayers, and your compassion. I've created a little video to try to commemorate the best of Buffy <laughs> and a little bit of Gypsy in there. <laughs> so uh, I hope you enjoy it. I was gonna go outside, but then I got high. I was gonna chase a little squirrel, but then I got high. I was gonna catch a itty bitty bird, but then I got high. I don't know why I'm on this floor, I guess I'm high. I was gonna go outside, but then I got high I was gonna lay out in the sun, but then I got high I was gonna sleep in this car, but then I got high I'm still on this kitchen floor, I think I'm high Gypsies in my box, I don't know why we're both on this kitchen floor, I think we're high Mama threw some catnip on the floor, I think I'm high I was gonna go outside, but then I got high Yeah, I was gonna go outside, but then I got high I was gonna chase me a little squirrel, but then I got high I was gonna catch a itty bitty bird, but then I got high. I don't know why, I don't know why, I just got high. Yeah, I don't know why, I don't know why, I got high. I'm just high.